Hey, everybody! If you love to read, then follow my lead. It's S T O R Y T I M E. Story time with S A N D I. Story time, Sandy. Tickle, tickle. <laughs> oh, hello there, little readers. What perfect timing you have. I was just waking up midnight. Hey, do you want to help me wake him up by saying the magic words and then we can all read a story together? Mm. Great. Are you ready? On the count of three. One, two, three. Sleep free midnight, please. Wake up fast. We'd like to read a story from the past. I said sleep be midnight, please. Wake up fast. We'd like to read a story from the past. Say it with me, sleep, be midnight, please. Wake up fast. We'd like to read a story from the past. <laughs> Little readers, you did it. Midnight's awake. Here we go. We. Okie dokie, midnight. What story did you find for us to read? Nambandla and the Chili Eating Contest Illustrated by Adrian Foley Notsron Written by Fortune Taz Vavinga And designed by Natalie Walker Nambandla the hare and Soko the monkey are buddies Hurry Soko, we don't want to be late for the chili eating contest, says Nambandla What kind of animal is Nambandla? She's a hare sometimes known as a rabbit. And there's Soko the monkey. Little readers, do you see all the chilies? And look, what does this say? It says, Hamba Hamba Fun Fair. That's the fun fair that Namvanpa and Soko are trying to go to by participating in the chili eating contest. Namvanpa, if you win, who will you take to the Hamba Hamba Fun Fair? Asked Soko. Do you see the fair? Look, it's a Ferris wheel. That's easy, says Namvandla. I'll take my best friend. Hmm. I wonder who Namvandla's best friend is. Little readers, who do you think Namvandla's best friend is? Soko sure looks sad. Do you think he's Namvandla's best friend? Hmm. Namvandla and Soko are the last to arrive. Look at all the other animals. Wow, the competition looks pretty tough. Soko, you go first, says Namvandla. Chili eating contest rules. Rule number one. Don't say how hot it feels. Number two, finish all your chilies. <coughs> Numbundla, I'm scared, says Soko. I'm not, says Numbundla. Little readers, do you see how frightened Soko looks? But Numbundla looks cool as a cucumber. She's ready. Hmm, those chilies do seem real hot. I don't think the tiger probably ate a lot. How many chilies would you be able to eat? Eesh! Eee! Maui! Hot! Eesh! Little readers, do you see all of these animals? Those chilies must be so hot! It's Numbandla's turn. She has a plan. <gasps> I wonder what I would do if I were her. What do you think her plan is, little readers? Soko looks pretty worried. Numbandla starts to sing. You say it's hot. I say it's not. The judges are surprised and ask her what she is saying. She carries on singing her song until the chilies are finished. There's the three judges. This story is even better than I thought. Hooray! Namvandla is the winner. 
You are my best friend, Soko. <gasps> Do you see? Navandal is giving her ticket to Soko. Yay! Whee! The story's all done. I hope you had fun with S T O R Y T I M E. Story time with S A N D I. Story time, Sandy. Midnight and I sure do love reading with all of you. <gasps> you know what else we would love to read? A special secret message written just by you. So grab a grown up and ask them to help you write a message for us down below. And hey, before you go, let's read another story together. All you have to do is click that box right there. Let's go! Well, aren't you coming? Come on, click the box and I'll see you in the next story. 